Sure. Well, April 28th uh, was uh, a Monday about midday, um, 40 or no, 55 million people um, in Spain and Portugal lost power. And um, now power since was restored within a day or two, but there's been a lot of finger pointing about what well, what caused this. And it is, I think, very obvious now in the recent in looking in the in the rearview mirror, looking at where it happened, why and and the timing that Spain's overdependence on alternative energy and in particular on solar was a key contributing factor to the blackouts uh, to this blackout. And uh, now, of course, that set off a whole challenge of people saying, oh, well, no, you can't. You're just anti renewable. You're you know, I'm speaking broadly, not just me because I've written a couple of pieces saying, yes, we can blame solar for this. And the reasons are obvious, including the fact that Red Electrica, which is the grid operator in Spain, had warned in February that, in fact, that was, it was very concerned about an over-reliance on, on solar, and it was causing uh, grid uh, the 